Hey guys, it's Eddie here at Veering RV Center in Grand Rapids, Michigan. We are actually inside of our showroom and I have the pleasure of showing you this brand new 2023. This is a Holiday Rambler Invicta. This is the 32RW. So it's gonna be a rear bedroom, mid bath, and then you'll see you have a dinette and theater seating up front. Cool thing is, Veering RV Center is actually the oldest Holiday Rambler dealer in the world. So just a fun little fun fact. Uh, and when it comes to this, I wanted to be sure to show you this floor plan just because we finally have Holiday Ramblers in stock. So we have two Invictas and one Admiral at the time of this video. But without further ado, I'm just gonna take you through, show you a few features. It's gonna be a nice short video, but it'll at least give you a feel for the floor plan and who Holiday Rambler is. So this being a Class A coach is gonna be kind of their, their mid tier. So. You're gonna have the Admiral, which is gonna be their kind of entry level, and then it goes up to the um, Vacationer, which is their actual higher higher end gas coach, and then their Invicta is kind of right in the middle. So it gives you a ton of different features while not really breaking the budget. So being a gas coach up front, you are going to have your engine uh, basically underneath where you're sitting, underneath the helm, uh, and then with a diesel pusher, uh, it's gonna be in the back. So with this being a gas class A, you are gonna have an outdoor entertainment space right here, which has a massive Sansui uh, smart TV. Basically have storage all throughout all of these bays on your actual uh, campsite side. And then you have a nice big awning, frameless windows, just gives you some luxury features um, on this coach. And then just showing you the back, you have your bedroom slide, which will be right here. It is going to be a king bed, and I'll show you that once we actually get inside of the coach. Uh, and then you'll have some more storage bays. An LP quick connect down there. Some more storage up here. And then you get to the back, where the Admiral is just going to be, basically you're just fiberglass back wall. When you get to the Invicta, you do have a fiberglass back cap. So if you do have like a rear ending issue, you can just replace the cap. You don't actually have to do a bunch of body work uh, to the coach. With it being uh, a gas Class A coach, this does have a Ford 7.3 liter uh, V8. So that's going to have 350 horsepower and you will be able to tow 8,000 pounds. So if you're towing a Jeep Wrangler, you can tow this no problem. Uh, or you can tow that no problem. And then on the back, you do have a ladder that leads to your roof, um, fully walkable roof as well. And you do have 100 watts of solar up there too. So just fun little thing. Um, let's head inside. Okay, so here we are in a 2023 Holiday Rambler Invicta 32RW. One thing that I didn't touch on on the outside is that this is a full body paint option. So no stickers, it's gonna be full body paint. Uh, when you do get in here, you'll notice that it's nice and spacious. You're going to have two slides. One's going to be your massive full wall slide on this floor plan. And then the other one, as I showed you on the outside, is actually in the back where your king bed is going to be. Something about the construction of these Holiday Ramblers is that this is going to be a fully aluminum and then also vacuum bonded structure. So basically your ceiling, your sidewalls, and your back cap is all going to be vacuum bonded. Just giving you a little bit more longevity when it comes to basically holding on to this thing for extended period of time. You want to hold on to it for 10 years, you want to make sure that it'll last 10 years. Uh, so basically right where we are in the living space is I'm hanging out in the galley. So right when you come in off your campsite side, take a right, you get right to your theater seating. So these will be nice and comfortable. They do recline and then you do have some seat belts right there. So if you're traveling with four people, you'll have no problem making sure that they're all safe as you're heading down the road. Then you get to your little dinette, which is gonna be across from it that will collapse down into uh, a sleeping space as well. And it's nice and easy. It's just a lever and then you just push it down. You're not, just, you're not gonna have posts that are in the center that you have to take them out or you're hitting your knees as you're going down. Um, as we head up front, Basically, this is your helm. So you do have a high loft up here that's gonna hold 600 pounds capacity. So it's just a nice extra space. Since you don't have any bunks in this coach, this just gives you a little bit more sleeping options. Up front, you're gonna have two swivel seats. These are your captain's chairs. They are super comfortable, by the way. And then, I mean, it's kinda, I mean, it's a Ford vehicle. So ultimately, it's gonna feel pretty, uh, pretty familiar. But you'll have a full control center up there on the left, this does have four point electronic leveling. Uh, so you will have no problem staying stable when you're at the campground. As we start heading a little bit towards the back of the coach, 
into your galley. So this is going to be all uh, all solid surface countertops. So that is an upgrade from some of the more entry level uh, versions of this coach and other entry level uh, coaches on the market. You do have those solid surface countertops. You do have a nice farm style stainless steel sink with a pull down sprayer faucet. Loads and loads of cabinetry in here. Lots of storage. So just checking out all that space. You do have your microwave right here and then your three burner and oven. So this is a recessed cooktop. And then you have your little Dometic oven right underneath there. Across from your galley is going to be your bathroom. So just check that out. They do some awesome finishes on this Invicta. So usually in coaches, I mean, this is only... It's a 32 foot floor plan, but technically it's going to be a little bit under 34 foot. You don't usually have this much storage in the bathroom. So being a mid bath, it's a little bit smaller than say a rear bathroom. Uh, but this gives you tons and tons of space. You do have a porcelain toilet. You do have a glass shower door. You do have a stainless steel sink and then a ton of storage space. Here's a little pantry space. So all of your canned goods, everything you need. To cook on the campsite, you can fit it all right in here. It's bigger than mine at home. Refrigerator is just going to be an insignia. It will be a 12 volt fridge. It will be 10 cubic foot as well. So bring whatever you need. A little bit more storage right here next to your refrigerator and then you get back to your main bedroom. Since it is an RW, like I said, I mean it's going to be a mid bath, but you also get a nice big rear wardrobe so opening that up you can just check out the space and the storage you will have some more over here and then right here it's already outfitted with a stackable washer and dryer king bed another little bit of a wardrobe right here but then you also have a tv that pops out right here from your countertop it's right behind your fireplace and that fireplace will actually kick a bunch of heat All right, thanks guys for checking out this video on Vurinx RV Center's YouTube channel. Again, I'm Eddie here at Vurinx. Uh, you can reach me at 616-965-9625. Again, this was just a quick walkthrough on a 2023 Holiday Rambler Invicta 32RW. If you have any questions, always feel free to reach out. I'll catch you on the next one.